Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode here on Pasties of Skin. Today we are looking at PlayStation Plus. The games that have been announced for Europe and America over the next month or so. Europe and America, and also Hong Kong. Now, if you have been paying attention to here in the channel, I've been telling people to go and get PlayStation Plus in an Asian country, in Hong Kong, in Malaysia, in anywhere, because of the interesting stuff that you can get. But you're going to find that if you haven't already done so, then uh, you're going to have a repeat month this month. There's going to actually be stuff in this month for the European American stores that you would have got last month already and been able to play. Uh, I'm just saying. But we'll take a look here and see what they actually have added to the actual month store materials that we're going to check out for the month of August. So it's, of course, Assassin's Creed, Freedom Cry, the standalone edition, and Just Cause 3. Just Cause 3 was a game that was provided last month as part of the PS Plus, alongside one of the, an extra free game, which was Darksiders 2. Now, Just Cause 3 and... Uh, a Freedom Cry, both fantastic games, really enjoyable experiences. They're going to be explosive, they're going to be super exciting, they're going to be fun to play, but uh, Just Cause 2 does not come with any, or Just Cause 3, sorry, doesn't come with any of its actual additional content. And of course, like I said, Freedom Cry is a standalone game. Now, if you didn't know what Freedom Cry originally was, it is a DLC content pack that was designed for Black Flag. So if you enjoy that parody goodness and that experience that Black Flag brought us, then you need to check it out as well. Of course, the games have been available previously uh, via PlayLink, that's you, it's still available in the month of August, so you might want to grab that as soon as possible if you've got a party coming along anytime soon. And of course, there's going to be a couple of PlayStation 3 games included in the pack for this month. Let's take a look to see if they actually show us in this video. Yeah, no, no way, they ain't doing that at all. So we're going to have to actually go and grab a reference material to find out which ones are actually available. Of course, the other things to be checking out, like I said, is the PlayStation Plus for the month of August in Hong Kong. And the only real difference in this month is that we are going to be getting the Amnesia Collection and Child of Light. Otherwise, we already have Just Cause 3 and we're also getting Freedom Cry. So the Amnesia Collection, I don't know if you're into it as much as I am, but I like a good scary game. It's just I've never been one of those people who enjoy doing the live streams on it. I might do it a little bit more for this month. And I already own Child of Light because it was a gorgeous, gorgeous Ubisoft indie game. So I recommend checking it out if you're willing to drop the $26 it requires to be on Hong Kong PSN. Now, I've obviously been getting a lot of messages about uh, how to actually log into. Oh, yes, by the way, Downfall is included. I completely forgot about Downfall. This is a weird-ass game, but extremely fun. Uh, literally, fall, blow as you can, and survive. I recommend checking that out as well. So the games for PS Plus this month have been pretty good. They're actually really interesting. But like I was saying, uh, we need to actually... I need to do a video for you guys to explain how to do... The Hong Kong account properly so I did a quick video that explained how quickly it is you can create an account but I've been asked for a number of questions on nearly every single social platform how do I get the money onto the account uh, what should I be using my own credit card can I actually use a gift credit card should I buy buying credit instead of actually buying something else there's a lot of ways you can use that account but I'm going to do a quick video to explain how to actually do each of those. So if you would like to check that out and you want to see that come out very soon, then comment underneath because the more people I know want to see it, then the quicker I'll get it done just so you guys can check it out. Hope you enjoyed finding out what the games for this month for PS Plus are. I recommend still that you go and make yourself an Asian account. Go and check it out. And in fact, I've got a little quick secret for you. The beta for Dragon Ball Fighter Z. if you have a Japanese account, you can go and sign up for it now. I'm going to show people how to do it in a wee bit and just prove that it's real. But the beta sign up is actually already available on the Japanese servers. But um, for everybody else, it's going to get delayed until mid August anyway. So uh, if you want to get in on that a wee bit earlier, then you should check it out. So a uh, quick little tip at the end there. And thank you very much for watching, guys. If you've enjoyed hearing what's being released and you want to keep up with this every single month, you want to follow this every single month, make sure to hit the subscribe button. I'll give you all the information I possibly can. Of course, all this information is publicly available on all the PlayStation channels if you just went and gathered them up yourself. But if you're not paying attention, then this is a quick way to find out. Um, if you don't do the subscribe thing, you don't like doing it, then make sure to just remember the name, Pastiche of Skin. All you have to do is search for me. I'm available. I'm here. I'm not trying to hide. You can find me if you need me. And I will be able to answer your questions as you send them. And of course, if you're watching this on YouTube, Yes, the button goes up right here, and over to here is the playlist, and away over to there is the most recent video, and right here is something for you, based on your YouTube analytics and other things that you watch on YouTube. If you're following my channel, it'll probably be something from one of my most recent videos, and if you're a complete stranger, I hope you actually enjoyed this. This is the video you should watch next. It'll be something that you should really enjoy, so I hope you actually check it out, and I will see all you dudes in the next news story. Bye.